Heart failure uh, as a cardiovascular diagnosis is the only diagnosis in cardiovascular disease that is actually rising in Canada. And uh, so one in five Canadian eventually will actually succumb to heart failure. And once you actually develop the heart failure, and if you get the diagnosis today, uh, one in four individuals won't actually be here a year from now. This is a silent uh, epidemic. It's almost a tsunami uh, that we are facing and that uh, it is very important that uh, the patients, uh, the physicians, uh, the health system uh, all are prepared to actually face this challenge together. So the symptoms uh, can sometimes be a little subtle. You know, a patient may feel more tired, uh, get a short winded doing, you know, the usual things. And quite often we attribute this just because we're aging and, uh, you know, things are just not going, you know, as easily as used to be. But in fact, these are very precisely the symptoms associated with the heart failure. In terms of the inpatient care, we are unique here in Canada uh, because we have one of the only dedicated inpatient services dedicated for patients with heart failure. We also have one of the largest transplant and VAD programs here in Canada as well. We have a mechanical circulatory support program in Ottawa. So patients who are either um, waiting for transplant and waiting a long time such that they may be getting more ill as they wait, or um, patients who are being evaluated for transplant can receive mechanical circulatory assist devices, heart pumps if you will, to help to keep them alive and keep them well as they, uh, as they wait for their heart transplant. On the outpatient clinic side, we offer uh, the, the range of these clinics that, uh, that run every single day, uh, and we continue to build our program. Uh, we are hoping to expand our heart failure program to be able to provide care and services uh, throughout the Ottawa and the Champlain Lynn as well. And then the other program that's new in our heart failure uh, uh, umbrella here in Ottawa is uh, a transitional care program. Uh, we've developed a formalized program to help to um, identify patients who are at the highest risk of readmission when they're admitted to hospital and provide them with a very solid fundamental support uh, and care uh, and plan as well to try to decrease admissions to the emergency room as well as to try to decrease readmissions to hospital. And that's a program that is also exclusive and unique here at the Heart Institute at this time. Before having my own heart failure, in my mind, heart failure, heart attack was one and the same. I didn't have any idea they were two separate items until actually experiencing it and getting educated into what heart failure was. It's so easy to say, oh, that's nothing, that's, it's not a heart attack, so I needn't worry about it, this can't be serious. So that if you're having anything abnormal occur, let a health professional know.